Russia redeploying heavy flamethrower thermobaric weapons to elite frontline troops in Ukraine. Russia has reportedly been using thermobaric weapons in the conflict in Ukraine, according to an investigation by the conflict intelligence team. The TOS-1A thermobaric rocket launcher system has been found to have been used by Russian forces. These weapons are highly destructive and can cause extensive damage to buildings and inflict severe injury, or death to people within their blast radius. The use of thermobaric weapons is controversial due to their indiscriminate nature and potential for causing civilian casualties. The TOS-1A Sontsepiok system is a combat vehicle, BM-1 based on a modified T-72A chassis and fitted with a rotating launch system for 24 unguided thermobaric rockets. All rockets can be launched within 6 to 12 seconds. The launch vehicle is equipped with a fire control system with a ballistic computer, aiming sight and 1D14 laser range finder. The other standard equipment consists of a TKN-3A site for the commander, a GPK-59 navigation system, an R-163-50U radio station, an R-174 intercom and a 902G smoke grenade launcher with four barrels. The three-man crew is armed with one AKS-74, one RPKS-74, three RPG-26, and 10 F-1 hand grenades. The BM-1 is fitted with the same equipment as the T-72 tank. TOS-1 was designed to attack enemy fortified positions and lightly armored vehicles and transports, particularly in open terrain. The system's first combat tests took place in 1988 and 1989 in the Panja Valley during the Soviet-Afghan War. The TOS-1 was shown for the first time in public in 1999 in Omsk. TOS-1 is not assigned to the artillery units of the Russian Armed Forces, but is found in Russian NBC protection troops. The idea of a heavy short-range MLRS to launch rockets equipped with incendiary and thermobaric warheads arose in the late 1970s. The combat system consisting of the combat vehicle, rockets, and loading vehicle was developed in early 1980s at KBTM in Omsk and was named TOS-1, remaining a secret development for a long time. The TOS-1 is intended to engage military personnel, equipment, and buildings, including fortified constructions. The TOS-1A Sontsepiok system entered service with the range extended to 6 km and a better ballistic computer. In March 2020, Russia introduced a new rocket for the TOS-1A with a range of 10 km, achieved in part by weight and size reductions of a new fuel-air explosive mixture in the warhead, while also increasing its power. Minimum range is extended from 400 to 1,600 meters, so the shorter range M0.1.01.04 M rocket will be retained for close combat environments. In 2018, Russian NBC protection troops received 30 TOS-1A Sontsepiok 220mm multiple rocket launchers.